what is poppin', man? Y'all already know what it is, and we back with another one, man. And today, you know we got... Once again, man. And today, we reacted to the DDG, Riley... I don't know. I guess they had like a misunderstanding, a, a, a contractual agreement. Something is wrong. Someone, someone wrong. And and I'm gonna say this. Like I say, I knew about. I, honestly, I never met Riley, but but DDG has showed me. He, she showed me like before. Like they had like I guess signed a little contract thing. I'm just giving y'all some behind like story. And he was like, bro, like what you think about her like signing to the Zooter or whatever. I'm like, nigga, you trying to talk to ain't you? Nigga, for real. I'm like, you trying to talk to ain't you? And he was like, uh, nah, bro. Like I'm really trying to sign it. So like. I think I heard her say something about, that's what I heard she said, something about like, uh, he tried to like get on me or something like that. I think I heard something like that, but I mean, DDG, I mean, DDG be really straight up to me. I mean, shit, he was saying he like, he wanted to sign her like, because he wanted to get, obviously what he doing now, like his YouTube empire, like, you know what I'm saying? Like he got Dan, he got like a lot of people he didn't sign to Zuda DNT, you know, Payway, uh, Lala, I mean, it's a lot of people he didn't sign, so... And that's where he kind of started with her. She was the first one. You know what I'm saying? So I just remember that. And um, just hearing that, I'm just kind of like, that's kind of off. Like, you know what I'm saying? So I don't really know too much going on. I just heard that. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I don't know if you know about Riley and DJ. I don't really know a lot of everything. <laughs> <laughs> on me, I'm just saying. I mean, that. I've seen her before in the videos, but I really didn't know, like, he had the whole... Yeah, I mean, I don't really know about too I much of anything. I'm just telling y'all what I heard. Like, DDG, we was in a car or whatever. We had just came back from the club. He was just, you know what I'm saying, showing, like, you know what I'm saying, what he was thinking about in the future and shit. And, that, you know what I'm saying, Riley was one of the things he was talking about. So, I'm just, shit, you know. We're going to get right into it, though. I ain't going to waste y'all time, you know what I'm saying. I'm trying to get right into the video, too, and just see what's going on. You know what I'm saying? So, you already know. I showed Riley so much love. I should have asked him about a laptop too. I gave Riley this laptop, bought her a camera, and I made, I helped make this girl a YouTube channel. She literally started at absolute zero. When I met Riley, she was at 3,000 subscribers. Now, how I met Riley, this is what you guys need to understand, but I'm not gonna specify it until I get into the reaction. How I met Riley, I met Riley, she came to one of my LA showcases, first time T.O. performed. If you guys are watch that video, that's the night that I met Riley. She came there, right? That was it. I met her. I seen the star potential. I was like, listen, you look like somebody. I kept and, telling her. And, the and see, night. and that's basically what I'm thinking that he telling me. Like, he was like, he might have saw her, but like, he was like, he saw something in her. Like, that's what I, I mean, you know what I'm saying? That's what he told me. Like, you shit, look I'm like, like you can be somebody. I just started this company. But if you want, let's go grab like a bite to eat. Let's go get a little bit of dinner or something. We went to Noble and Malibu. We talked about the business, everything. Woo, woo, wah, wah. Signed, and we got to work. Then she got 200k in a month. Now let's get into the reaction. That is the whole backstory. I looked out for Riley more than Ooh. any other person. That's why I'm so highly disappointed that she decided to throw dirt in my name. But we don't get into me, this. And on me, and that's why I really, before I even get to it though. Video without further ado, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Let's get it. Let's go. He said, "Now I'm mad." <laughs> All right, y'all. Um, I was gonna set the camera up, set the um. Try find another one. I don't feel like editing this video because it's really. Once I make this video, it's done. I'm not talking about Riley anymore. Um, it's over with. Point blank period. I'm not. I have nothing else to say to this girl. I'm not even high by anything. If I've seen Riley, I wouldn't even speak to her after this. I'm very, very disappointed. <laughs> I'm disappointed. I'm very, very disrespected. Oh, but, um, shit. Talk. I'm going to just show y'all the video so y'all don't even got to go watch it. Don't even go watch a video. Point blank period. Um, let's see. Hey. I'm finally things going on with my channel, with me, with how you guys feel about me, and a lot of things that just haven't made sense. For starters, with the way we met, you know, like, I didn't, like, say the right way where we met because he didn't feel like it was going to be appropriate. Because the same way he met Seven, he met me. I met him in the club. Here's a video of me and him in the club. This was the day of my birthday. I met him through a friend. He liked me at that moment. Oh! <laughs> he oh, needs yeah. some milk! This is very, this is very unfortunate. This is disappointing. I don't want you, Riley. This is a sound effect. And oh, and oh, no bull. This is no bull. I swear to God. DDG told me this. This is on my mind. We was in the car. Matter of fact, no, no, no. This was like a few days later. I think after he got her signed, I swear to God, DDG was, I was still like, I was like, nigga, you gonna try to, uh, basically, I was like, you trying to get up. Basically told me, like, she just gonna be doing videos with the YouTubers. Like, it wasn't nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. On me. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, 
That shit is crazy. Like that, even that this is being brought up, I feel like that's crazy. Despite of you, you having know? a boyfriend, despite of anything, point blank period. If I wanted you, I could have had you, and you know that. We both know that. First time that Tio performed, if you guys want to go back and find it. I met Riley that night. She came to the little LA showcase with one of my homies. It was the nigga that was in the Cloud Chasing video, actually. He was in the Cloud Chasing music video. And when I seen her, I was like, you look like you can be somebody. That was basically it. I was like, you look like you can be somebody. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Now, I'm not going to sit here and act like Riley is ugly. She's not ugly, okay? But in reality, Riley, you're not fucking with any of my exes. You're not fucking with any girls that I really do mess with. I'm not attracted to you like that. I wouldn't put my neck out on the line. That's why I did business with you. I don't want you. Like, if I wanted you, I wouldn't have did business with you. Point blank, period. That's what you don't get. I didn't. <laughs> I got this I sound effect. No that's what I'm like. That's what I said. We've been on this couch right here. I'm talking about Riley has been over my house until like 1 in the morning. Don't touch her. Swear to God on my life. I never touched Riley. Never kissed her. Never hugged her. Nothing. Like, I put that on the I never did anything, anything to even try Riley or even spark that interest in her mind. And when you was out here, Riley, you was messing with a lot of other dudes. Wow. We, used to, we used to talk about your boy. <laughs> and then you went to Chicago and you started dating this dude. Which is cool. And what did I tell you? I told that, you Riley, DDG, like, you want to expose, then let's tell it. Oh, damn. You you like, you trying to expose, then let's tell it. Light skins. They like light skins on this platform. Film with them. Get a lot of views. You think I was jealous? My bad. Let me pause this real quick. Just make this make sense. Riley, if that is true, if I'm jealous of you having a boyfriend, is this the same why? Yeah, yeah I, I think he like went same. later and thought about it and was like, I gotta put that shit in there. <laughs> why am I working with Lala that has a whole boyfriend? Why did I sign Danny? He's a whole dude. So it don't make sense. Something don't sound right. No me. Your time has come. You're done, you're done, you're done. Get right to the Facial interest or rejection all the time. You're done now. A contract type deal with the I don't want you. I promise you I don't want you. I promise you. I'm flattered that you thought that, but I do not want you. And I say that in the most respectful way possible. Never ever tried. I'm sure if you guys have ever been to like these types of clubs in Hollywood, there's a lot of people who always want to give you opportunity. A lot of men, a lot of men go out and What did he say? There's a lot of people who always want to give you opportunity. A lot of men, a lot of men go out and Who are you? Who are you? <laughs> and why are you in the video? This has nothing to do with you. I don't even know your name. <laughs> Bro, listen. The amount of money that I made off Riley can't pay a bill that I have. Not even a fraction of it. Like I, like the amount of money that I, let me tell you. Okay, I'm gonna give y'all a little backstory since we get personal. Riley, you was a personal assistant when I met you. You had no YouTube. You had three thousand followers on. No Instagram. YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> And, and that's what blows my mind. Honestly, and that's what blows my mind about this one, this situation in particularly, because if you had nothing then you obviously you worked for it but it's like I helped you along in that process too so how could you just go behind my back and start talking shit about me you feel me I don't think that's cool I, I mean I gotta I guess I gotta hear the other side but I don't I don't see how that's cool you were probably making I don't know how much you was making but you I remember you told me you was probably making like three thousand four thousand dollars a month maybe no, but probably like $3,000 a month doing your personal assistant job, right? The first month of me and you working, you made over $23,000. $23,000 compared to what you made. See, that, and that's what I'm saying. It, it blows my mind. Like, how could you not, like, appreciate that? The second month, you made over $16,000. Still more than what you made in three. When we you making working. triple of what you making. Or, is that triple or quadruple? Man. Oh. Uh, I don't made. know. Four thousand in that month. Then you made three thousand 
And for the month of April, you made six hundred dollars, right? Oh, that oh, 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 You to call it for your <laughs> meathead ass boyfriend to call this an opportunity? No, this is bigger than opportunity on God. Are you serious? Don't ever disrespect my business like that. Come on, don't, talk don't your disrespect shit. Disrespect my business, my talk your shit. Talk your shit. I made you a it. boss, a superstar. No me. Talk your shit. Point blank, period. It's disrespectful for you to come on here and try to. <laughs> hey, cuz, hold on. We gotta congratulate DDG, though, cuz he ain't talking no bullshit right now. You know what I'm saying? DDG really been blowing it up right there. Like, he been blowing this shit up, though, to me. You know what I'm saying? That nigga work ethic is crazy, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Just being around this nigga for this amount of years and shit like that, bro. I told that nigga, I'm like, bro, your work ethic inspires me, nigga. Like, I swear to God, this nigga, he work hard as fuck. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really, like, far as, like, as far as the internet, like, I ain't never really just seen no nigga work this hard to just put his fucking mind together on some shit, like, you know what I'm saying? Just me, that's just me, though, you know what I'm saying? From what I've seen and experienced, though, this nigga is one of the <laughs> best niggas to me, though, for real. Oh, God. Yeah. I talk down. Oh, yeah, yeah, you, I mean, shit. I mean, he just, yeah. He that just, nigga, shit. I don't know. He, he work like, he do this internet, but when he's so, like, calm when you see him, so it's like, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, me. It's crazy how he is. You and yeah. me. Yeah. Oh, me. It's crazy. Oh, me. My name, like, I ain't put hella money in your pocket. What's wrong with you? Now, I'm honestly getting pissed, bro. So I can reach phone leads and, like, branch up pretty much. And for that, people get a percentage of the money of whatever I make. Rightfully so. Both were in an agreement. I would be doing all the work, though. He would show me how to do it, but I would have to do everything. And I was like, of course. Okay? I edited, uh, I edited a few of Riley videos. That's not in the contract. That's not in the contract. <laughs> I, do, I did so much for this girl, like... I literally created the video. But honestly, the, that's what I'm. That's what you pay. You pay to learn. Like DDG can't sit there and do every video. He got his own shit going. Like you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And the fact that he helped you get to twenty three thousand dollars compared to three thousand dollars what you was making. Like come on, man. That's automatically. I don't know. I just. I, I don't know. Y'all yeah, tell me. The video for. You oh, gotta be grateful. Video, I would home. never, if somebody showed me how to make oh 20 my God. No, no, because I'm getting like I'm getting kind of mad though. Because I get if you. somebody, if somebody helped me make twenty three thousand dollars and I was making three thousand dollars at one point, like I'm gonna be like, I appreciate you. You didn't show me another way, cause now I can make the three thousand with know, that turn into six. I mean, I mean anything, bro. Like you, you found another another avenue, another revenue. You see, like he helped to become like greater. Like obviously she had to work, but nigga, you have to work when you do anything. Like you know what I'm saying? So that kind of upsets what, me because I'm looking at it from his side. Like I said, I don't really know her side all the way. I'm looking at this That's video. That's why I said, what is her video exposing? Did you say, what is the title exposing him? Like, I don't know what it is. I'm just saying, is like, this is just crazy because I'm listening to But if you listen to numbers, don't lie. If you was making 3000 and I made twenty three, the next, like, that, you'd be grateful for that. Like, how do you go behind somebody back, especially if they ain't, like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I mean, I, mean, I, I got to watch more. Maybe her channel with her. Like, I literally set her down, made her Gmail, created her YouTube channel, got her a profile picture, a YouTube banner. I literally created the whole channel. Yeah, because he know, she don't know what she's doing. Like, he, he's helped. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Do you see what I'm saying, though? Like, oh, God, that's crazy. I think this correct. To me, though, you know what I'm saying? It could be different to you. I don't know. You let me know what you think, because... I mean, for, for him... Yes, because he could be doing a lot of other things with his time as far as helping somebody. I mean, any problems they had or she had, she didn't have to necessarily. They could have talked that shit out, probably. Hey, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, you don't got to go to the internet with it. Mm hmm. I mean, if somebody really did help you and they had a genuine heart towards you, then why would you do that? Yeah. I don't know. I, I didn't never watch Riley's video. Oh, yeah, yeah. So no, no, that's what I'm saying. I'm not trying to say. I'm, say, I'm speaking on really, this. I'm, like you say, we, we're we not really saying nothing about. I'm, not trying to bash I'm only guys, speaking on this I video. Know. I'm not bashing nobody. I'm no, not really not trying either, to. But I'm you're not just trying like to. I'm very strongly No, I strongly opinionated this. because I got a different way of thinking. You feel me? Because once you learn the game, why would I have to go talk about somebody, though? You feel me? Like I'm not. I don't know both sides. I'm not I don't saying know I'm just speaking on this one all. video right here. So. If, if I go watch the other video, I might have a different opinion. But I'm gonna speak on this perspective. It's from what I see right now. Like I'm not gonna go behind somebody back who showed me how to make 23k, a different revenue, a stream of revenue. Why would I do that? 
No matter, no matter how we end it, if it ended, whatever. Why would I go back and try to like? That's just me though. I'm not that person. You know what I'm saying? I'm not that person. I'm, I don't want to speak up. And that's why it's me. I'm more, I can only talk about what I'm thinking. You know what I'm saying? Because of who he is, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's Matter of fact, let me make a call real quick. I don't know. Shit. Don't ask me. Oh my God. Hello? Yeah, it's my bad. Hey, let me ask you this quick question. Yeah. You remember when we did that, um, the Silent Library video? Yeah. What did I say? Remember you asked me to pull up? What did I say? I said I'm not pulling up if who can't come. I'm not pulling up to what? When we did that Silent Library video, <laughs> I told you I'm not pulling up to do the video with you unless who can't come. Oh, unless I need to pull up. Because you wanted, you had, I did get just fine there and you were trying to like, you know, help her build her brain and stuff. Alright, that's all. Alright. Right. You f***ed up right now. I want you to know that <laughs> be literally the dumbest thing you could ever do. Well, I started to think it would be serious. And I thought when you first saw me about it, that it was obviously just something you trying to hit on you with the club. Yeah. But when he bought you a camera, <clears throat> or when he's actually started teaching you stuff, and it seemed like maybe this guy is about business, maybe she just got really lucky at this club. And that was when the video idea came. Yeah, that's when that's when DDG suggested to Riley that I thought should have done. Your friends? Fake. Your relationships? Fake. Oh. You put them all online for the world to see. I met this man once. Who is that? <laughs> I met him one time. I met him one matter of fact I met him twice. I met him off camera and I met him when we played basketball. You don't know me. Point blank, period. We became super close, and the closer we got, the more information we shared with each other. And I told him about a person that I liked, which was I described him in my videos, a light skinned guy with tattoos, like a person with red hair, like, you know, like he just. You know, <laughs> <laughs> she got that nigga blush. He like, <laughs> he like oh, you talking about me? Highlight. Uh, <laughs> like, 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 it was not serious until I started taking vacations. They look alive. They and got high. Like, so I don't know. I don't like this hair. Riley went to Chicago for ten days. I told Riley to film what this do. I told her to. She decided she didn't want to film. She didn't want to put him on the internet. Whoop whoop. Whatever. Okay. Cool. I get it. Soon as she got back from Chicago, all her views, and she got back, and she got mad at me. Like, it was my fault. I told Riley when she went out there, you should film because you're not going to have no new content. They don't want to watch this bullshit content that you posted. So I'm giving her real advice. On this me. video is nothing. Giving and, then, and then think about it from his perspective. If he knows it's bullshit content, pure jealousy vibes she's just she literally got a hundred percent jealous when i started signing new people because she wanted all of my attention she wanted me to keep growing her and all this other stuff which is typical la female stuff you get used out here left and right and this is a very very prime example and a lot of y'all in the comments y'all can see right through this girl man like she's completely 100 percent fake and ungrateful i cannot believe this she thinks that i got jealous because she started dating another Riley I don't want you how many times do I have to say that you look like him <laughs> you look just like him oh my I God. don't oh want God. you seriously I do not want no, you no don't I do wanted it. you to film with him so we can both make my him you look just like him that's the double <laughs> this is funny though. No lie. That's funny. I don't want you. Seriously, I do not want you. I wanted you to film with him. So we can both make money, dummy. What are you talking about? Like <laughs> He likes it. If you ain't making money, I ain't making money. Be real. Yeah, we got close. Yo girl's messing with other dudes in LA, my brother. <laughs> You sitting here biting your lip. Your girl was messing with other dudes. I know because she told me. Oh, I was her friend. I was talking to her about her boy problems. 
You trying to act oh, all person on this video. You should have never, I told you, I texted you, I said, I don't get no personal me. info on there. I warned her in the nicest way. Hey, don't do it. Do. <laughs> he was messing with all types of dudes out here in LA. Oh, all types of dudes out here, man. And then you went to Chicago because you said you like him. I'm like, all right, cool. Y'all get a relationship, cool. But you acting single, so I'm like, just be careful. Woo, all this other stuff. Just being a friend. You come back, don't film with him. Your views plummet. You come back here, get mad at me, cuss me out. I said, we done. I'm not taking no disrespect. I because I didn't need to. I created all these other videos before I left. I was on vacation at this point. And he knew you were going. And he knew I was going. So then after that, I came back and it was just like a problem. He didn't want to shoot videos with me anymore. He just like made it very clear that he was taking his space, so I worked even harder. Yeah, I understand this. He made it like little business out of it. He the piece of the video. But Riley got back from Chicago for two days. I am busy, Riley. I don't work Thank you. for you. Thank you. That's why I said in the last video. You worked you for me. You came back here and you fell off because you went out to Chicago and you didn't post. You was posting nonsense videos, fully edited, not real, not genuine. They didn't like them. You was getting 20,000 views a video. You came back to LA. You wouldn't get no money. And then you try to cuss me out because I'm busy. Like I work for you. But he's been real facts though. He working working working, but he wasn't it sound, to me, I ain't gonna lie, from Lou's standpoint, it sounds to me like it's just mm -hmm. a sob story. From Lou, me, nigga be Lou. Oh. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm saying it feels like a sob story though, from her side. From me. If somebody showed me, why are you mad? And he, if, if it was really two days, like that means you just like Oh my, you just fetching, you just fiending for some attention. That's what I feel like it is. You fiending for some attention. Like, this is a long haul thing. You know what I'm saying? Because like you say, if DDG, like, you decided not to film with dude. You know what I'm saying? And keep your views going on some authentic. Because pre-recorded videos never work. To me, I don't think they do all the time. Like, sometimes they don't. Like, the pre-recorded ones, like you say, they're not genuine and you can't. Yeah, bro. It's like, did nobody want, if, if, if didn't nobody really want the content, you know what I'm saying? He know what he talking about. Why wouldn't you listen? This motherfucker got three million, four million subscribers. Like, makes sense. But, you know, already. So I don't, like I say, I don't think it's wrong. And DDG got a lot of shit going on himself, though. You know what I'm saying? He got music, so, all this other shit. He wasn't pulling up that part of our. And country. honestly, I'm looking at both sides too. Like, I think I'm looking at both sides, and I just, and, and, I, and from my point, I feel like. Know, and I didn't want for him either. It was you do one, I do one, we get this. You know. And I understand that he was busy and that he has a lot of things going on, trust me, I know. But it's still the fact that I was another part of his business that needed to be taken care of the same way of any other business that was going on. If That's what you call jealousy. Strictly jealousy. If I can't allow myself to go do some other things while you can uphold your point without us having to, like you said, go to this, Standpoint of the internet, I feel like that's wrong. My mm -hmm. personal opinion. Like, you heard what he said. Like, she was like, basically, I wanted to be there, like, every time. Like, I wanted, every time I post, I want him posting on his page. That's what it seemed like to me. That's just what, that's what's being said. You, you listening? You do one, I do one, we get this, you know? And I understand that he was busy and that he has a lot of things going on. Trust me, I know. But it's still the fact that. I was another part of his business that needed to be taken care of the same way of any other business that was going on. If That's what you call jealousy. Strictly jealousy. I really don't want to watch this whole video, y'all. I don't really think it's jealousy, though. But like I say, I think it's just like... He, she's saying he's saying he got je she got jealous of other people. other people because he was having to give his time to other people. But like I said, I do know the other side about um, like you say being neglected too. Far as like if they nobody show if we was doing this and then I stayed out for a little bit and then it just still just kept separating. And that's a thing too that might you know what I'm saying could have been a thing too. I think with that what you're saying is like her feeling like because of the fact that he she leaned on the fact that that was like what brought her that quick. Yeah. come up and she was like damn I need this and I need to let you like you know they should have been probably doing he, she should have been more it, it needed to be more like sometimes you can't be people's friends when you're doing business with people because you know that's 
people start to like not respect the business as much or I can be lenient or I can take a break or you know what I'm saying? But or oh I can be I'ma like, say that know. though in the beginning it looks like she took a break though. That's she what I'm the, saying. You know what I'm saying? Because he That's told her it was like. gonna be so like, now but when she went to come back and do business, it was like he's he's like, Oh no, you I'm took not took ten days off vacation, anymore. exactly. I'm but, like this is a job. Because like, it's you know a consistency I mean? type deal. YouTube is yeah. about consistency. If it's a so, contract thing, like you, you took a you took a paper and you took a job, like you, you know what I'm saying? Like so you made a decision to like kinda of take take off from work. Like you know, it's me. like everybody's working, he's working. And not to say I'm just taking any sides either, but it's just kinda of like it, it looks like you was getting she was getting her bread and then she stopped getting her bread and it was kinda of like dang. Because somebody showed her a whole completely new and way. And it was like so fast. It was like and it's dead. hard to catch on to that without help. So you need consistent help. But he just jumped her up so fast to where she never kind of probably got that that grit that comes along with with it coming up every year. Yeah, yeah, so okay, she's I like, damn, I'm struggling. I need to get the same views to get the same money. But it oh, takes work for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's a good, that's a good fucking point. A good circle of, of that's people a good and, you know, being networking. Nah, real and, shit, though. It moving too. around. But if you got people like her brother, then they probably was dirty, dirty talking down on DDG. Like, oh, boom, 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 boom. Because what, what she did was still wrong. I feel I like, mean, maybe. I think that it just feels some type of way, but. You know, because of the fact that that was something that. Cause then, like you say, this was a great opportunity for her. Like you say, a superstar over damn near overnight. He was, she was rising. Videos going crazy. But like you say, you this shit you can't take a break with. You just be playing around ten days and shit. And the this thing not, is, we didn't. I'm not, not even beginning. trying to bash her at all or nothing either. It's just that you can still, she can still do it. Like, no, no, it just yeah, takes yeah, yeah. that consistency. Welcome on, guys. Today I'm here with my girl team, hey, and we gonna spill some tea. Yeah, so, uh, yeah. about Zooted. Did you get a contract? Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, we got a contract. Everything was great. From the jump, he was straight with business. We did everything, like creating content every single day. It was great. And then all of a sudden, why is he here, bro? <laughs> Who is that? Bro, dead. She making you look bad, bro. <laughs> like we started to get to take to get more personal, like talking about relationship side. He talked about his. I talked about mine. It was very clear that I had somebody this whole time. And then when that somebody, as in my boyfriend Trey, became official, it, it just, everything like fell through cracks. When did all this happen? This happened, like when did you stop um, working with him? It was March 7th. March 7th? Yeah. Yeah, yes. so just a couple of days after me and him stopped working. Oh, just what? two days after me and him stopped working together. First of all, I hit Tia, I came back, where did I come back from? I think I came back from Mexico or something. I came back from somewhere, out of, I came from out of the whole country. Or somewhere, I was coming in, and as soon as I land, I text T, let's link, let's do a video. She immediately texted me back talking about, no, because you ain't hit me back to do a video, blah, 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 all this other stuff. T, I don't know why you're in this video. Like, I didn't make, I made zero dollars off of you. I don't even think you should even be in this video. There's no point. Go about your business. Do your, whatever you do. There's no point in you being in this video. I have nothing to say about you, and I do not care what you have to say about me. I'm honestly done watching this video, y'all. I'm just trying to Riley. I honestly, I just want to see how, right. I want to see how you can do it on your own, Riley. I really want to see how you can do this on your own. I want to see you. Bro, I want to see you get a million subscribers. I want to see you do all this other stuff because this month you only made six hundred dollars, man. And I want to see, I want to see if you can, you know what I'm saying, pull up. I want to see if you can pull it through and make a lot of money like I made you in the first couple months of us working. Since I ain't doing nothing, since I ain't doing nothing for you, right? So what I need you to do, I need you to do. If you're watching this video right now, and I never do this, unsubscribe from Riley. Let's see, let's see how, let's see how many, let's see how Riley can work. On Let's see if she can do it all on her own. So I need y'all to go right. to Riley channel, unsubscribe. Let's just see. Let's just see, man. Let's see. I really want to see how you can do it on your own, man. This is very, very disrespectful for you to come on here. My whole point of signing Riley was like, I want to see if I can start somebody from zero. And guess what? It worked. Zooey and T, man. Come over here and get your money. Riley turned me off so much. He's <laughs> like, I don't even feel like I can trust no girl out here and, and to even try to put them on game to this shit, man. Unsubscribe from Riley. That's all I have to say. I want to see Riley at zero. Dang. 
So will we. Showing them niggas ain't giving us up dope Take a percentage of shit in your ropes Business is business, you know how they go I got the money, the family, the bitches I'm fucking your missus, she really don't love you I'm about to fly her outside in the country And play with the kitty, but never gonna cover you yeah! Our website's really Crazy video, y'all, no lie Crazy video, man, a lot to talk about, man yeah. A lot to talk about, man So shit, y'all know what it is, man I appreciate y'all for coming to watch this, man Lou Up Gang Appreciate y'all, me. Y'all stay quarantined up, man. Wash your hands. Wash your ass. Remember, don't do crack and cocaine. Follow me, all of the score, Instagram and Twitter. Follow Diamond B. Diamond Red Tie on Instagram and Twitter. You already know what it is, man. We gone.